Now with the heat cranking into high gear, let's check in with meteorologist Griffin Hardy. He's live at Unity Park right now to explain the current setup and how it got the nickname of the Ring of Fire. Hi Griffin. Hi, Chris. Yeah, we're at the splash pad here at Unity Park. Lots of people outside enjoying the uh, lovely cooler water as the heat definitely cranks into higher gear. It's definitely not as hot as it could be today uh, because of the storms that came through Georgia earlier this afternoon. The fountains <laughs> really going off behind me. So we're in the 80s right now, but we could very easily be in the 90s with this setup that we have, which has the nickname the Ring of Fire. So let's talk about it a little bit more. So what that means is you have a strong heat dome over the Mid-South, which is what we're seeing right now across Louisiana, Arkansas. That's where the heat index is in the 110s, even low 120s in some places. Just crazy how hot and humid it is over there. And then to the north of that high pressure, you've got heat and humidity as well across the Midwest and Ohio Valley, and where the upper level winds are stronger. It's really strong. Stormy. And all those storms that are firing up because of the way the winds are oriented right now, those storms that do pop up in the Midwest and the Ohio Valley, they come racing down towards us. So there's a chance we could see low and mid 90s with this setup. But if those storms do pass through our area, it could really hold us back from seeing a lot of that heat. And that's what we saw earlier today with all the clouds from those storms over in Georgia. So uh, main thing I want to, you know, despite all of that, the heat will come at some point. So here's some tips I want to keep in mind for everybody out there. Number one, always wear shoes in heat like this. Asphalt can get especially hot up to around 140 degrees on some of those really hot days. Number two, drink plenty of fluids. Your sweat uh, is, it needs to constantly be replenishing itself. So drink a lot of water on days like this. And number three, have a dry towel to wipe yourself off with. It's not just hot, it's really humid too. And that high humidity means your sweat can't evaporate as easily and your sweat evaporating. That's how your body naturally cools itself off. So have no dry towel that'll help keep yourself cool on these really hot dog days summer that we have coming ahead. So inevitably it is going to get really hot. Chris will be talking about when coming up next for now reporting live in Greenville. Meteorologist Griffin Hardy. I'll send it back to you.